We needed our sins dealt with, and you dealt with our sins by giving us Jesus Christ on the cross to pay our debt. He gave us new life by his resurrection. And as he's seated at your right hand, we know that one day we will be in your presence completely pure and holy and perfect so that we might be more well-suited to sing your praises. This beautiful gospel message is nothing that we deserve. And yet you give us, you give us the good news. I pray, Lord, that all of us here would live like this is the greatest news the world has ever heard. I pray, Lord, that you would motivate us and remove blindness from our eyes and let us number our days so that while we still have breath in these lungs that you have given us, we might use that breath to proclaim the gospel to the ends of the earth. Help us, O oh God, to be your people, a holy nation, a kingdom of priests, a people of your own possession, and use us in a way that you would see fit to call people to your name and to worship you. We ask this thing, we ask these things, by your grace and by your mercy and by your power, because we know that you can do these things. We ask these things in the powerful name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Amen.